Hey guys, three more exercises you can do at home um, involving your core using this Swiss ball. Okay, let's get started. Everyone's familiar, or most of you are familiar with bus drivers. Okay, we're going to add a little dynamic element to it, the uh, Swiss ball itself. Okay, you're going to sit right on the edge, body supported with the heels. You're going to lie back. You're going to find that point where you feel like you're moving around, but you're not moving around too far, too much. You still have control. You're going to lie back, hands in the center of the chest. Grip them however you want, and twist side to side. Very slow and controlled, okay? Left to right is one, okay? Left to right is one. So you do one, two, three, four, all right? You have 20 total, okay? You're gonna feel a little bit in your quads. It's gonna help stabilize the body. Again, so you're involving more than just the core, okay? Moving on. You're gonna do what we call knee ins, okay? You're gonna take your position, the push-up position, putting the ball underneath the feet, or on top of the feet, rather. Supporting the body with the palms, straight up and out. Keep the head up. Your goal is to keep your hips below the shoulder. Roll the knees in, back out, okay? Make sure you have a good grip with the feet. In, back out. Try to keep the hips below the shoulders, okay? Those you have 10 of. Last exercise. A plank. Everyone's familiar with the plank, okay? Again, the dynamic element in this, in this situation is the ball, okay? A variety of ways. Most graduated level, you're going to take a knee, elbows on the ball, straight up. You're going to hold this position, okay? You're, again, your goal is not to move too much, okay? If that's too hard, by all means, knees. But do not have your weight back. You want all your weight forward as far as you can. Okay? Hold this for about 30 seconds, or as long as you can. Okay? So the three exercises, 10, 10, 30 seconds. Good luck.